What in tarnation? You have a deer carcass as a weapon? What is up, Jolly Gang? Welcome back. I hope you are doing well. Um, this is called Blasphemous. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, this is a game I've been wanting to play. This is the start of a new, this is episode one of, uh, of a new game series that we're going to do. Um, it's basically like a Metroidvania roguelike 2D platformer game. Uh, prepare for me to rage and probably get mad. I'm going to have fun, but I know I'm going to suffer. Uh, it looked pretty difficult, so I hope you enjoy my suffering, but let's get into it. Before, As always, actually, make sure you take a sip of water, sit up straight, and I uh, hope you enjoy. So, let's click this. Pilgrimage. Alright, new game. Let's see what's going down. It is not the sun rising, but our sins. Anonymous. It's a pretty dark game. It's gonna be gore and stuff, and like a darker theme, so. A bit different than Katana Zero, that's for sure. Because it is my guilt, I claim you grievous miracle. Make my chest hurt with regret. Oh God! Fought your punishment and nailed it deep. Shake my guilt once again. Oh no! Oh, that's delicious. Oh wow! Dear God, what, what game are we playing, boys and girls and other known species? It's gonna be interesting. It's like Castlevania almost like, but pretty gory. And thus, guilt, repentance, mourning, and every pain of the soul of all kind were visibly and tangibly manifested everywhere and in all of us. Sometimes in the form of blessing and grace. Sometime in the form of punishment and corruption. <clears throat> that divine will, equally pious and cruel, which we could not and will never be able to unravel, was called the miracle. Ooh. Symbol kind of reminds me of the symbol from Berserk. If you watch anime and you know that anime, it reminded me of. Is this where we come in? Oh, I think that's us. I like the art style. I'm down with it. Can't turn my fan on. Brotherhood of the Silent Sorrow. Of the fan, of bumper. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Press left bumper to consume one of your biliary flasks and recover vitality. These consecrated flasks are refilled by kneeling in a pre-do. I do pre-do. Find empty vessels to increase the amount you can carry. Okay. Full beans. I'm assuming we do it again. Yeah. Okay. Jump in, some some back action, some dodging. Okay. Oh, this is like an inventory. Oh, there's a lot going on here. This game seems pretty in depth. Rosary beads, relics, quest items, me culpa hearts, prayers, abilities, collectibles. I wonder what left bump or left trigger does. Uh, I want to mess with what is oh, this is the map. Oh, interesting. I want to mess with controls. How do you get out of the game actually? <laughs> oh, game options. There you go. All right. Um, what the sound kind of? We'll test it. We'll, we'll see. See what works. 
Okay, of course. We can climb down stuff, or we can jump up. Or we could be cool with the parkour. Okay. Crouch down. Right trigger, slide. Oh, I see. So you just do that again. Alrighty, alright, alright, alright. We break those. Pre-do. I really hope I can pronounce this correctly. It's pre-do. Pre-do? Press Y to rest of the pre-do. Saving your game and refilling your health and flask. Upon death, you will respawn at the last visit of pre-do. Uh, resting will cause enemies to respawn. Oh, that's Dark Soul. Is Dark Souls vibes right there. Alright, so this is our checkpoint basically. I wanna know like what I can destroy and stuff. Looks like a place where enemies would be. Okay. That's a massive human monster. Not a human. Warden of the Silent Sorrow. Uh we're fighting right off the bat. Okay. Not sure how loud the music is. Oh, he's got me into a corner. Can I like go this way? Oh! Oh, we dodged that. Woo! Come on. Come on. Tell me what you're really made of. Let's go, let's go, boy. That's so tough. Oh, Jesus, say that, and I finally got hit by that. Ooh! We created more space. Okay. Not oh, good. Okay, uh, that is not good. We gotta eat that. There we go. Right into it. Boss. Okay. Requiem Eternum. Let's go, boys. <laughs> this is so dark. Here we go. So I am a human. Don't tell me I'm gonna drink that blood. Don't tell me I'm gonna drink that blood. What in the hell? This, this game is... <laughs> oh god. Alright, that was very interesting. Uh, let's go over here. So, I want to go into the door. Brotherhood of the Silence. You need a key to enter the chamber of Eldest Brother of Nestor, press any button. There's this place called the Holy Lion. Regretful be the heart, penitent one. The anguish of the Eldest Brother has now come to an end. I am Deo Gracias, witness to and narrator of the acts of the grievous miracle. Such is my penance, as yours is silence. Ooh. The cradle of affliction is what you seek. This can be found in the mother of mothers of the churches. It is a remote place separated from the rest of these lands by a great sacred and forbidden door. Even a wise penitent like me knows nothing of what lies beyond those high walls. However, what I do know is that, according to the rule, one must carry out the three humiliations to gain access to what they guard. One of them must be performed in the high mountains, 
covered in thick blankets of snow and ice. Another in the depths of a dark, entombed church where the sleeper lies. Mm. And the last one at the end of the trail carved by moles that claw their way out of an iron spiral. In the bowels of the bell named Hondo that grows into the earth. Take this thorn and place it on the handle of your sword. If, when the time comes, as you grip your weapon firmly, you notice that it wounds you and makes you bleed. Having grown with more thorns sprouting from it, writhing over the figure of the father carved into the knob, that will mean that you are at the mercy of the grievous miracle, whether for its punishment or its forgiveness. Interesting. But this thorn will hurt me. Inventory, you can check out the items you have found so far in your inventory while press while playing. Press select to open it. Okay. Uh the, sorry. Sorry. Mogget from Dio Gracias. Nailed into the effigy, effigy of the twisted under the guard of your sword, the thorns arisen from the miracle feed on sin and guilt, growing with the burden that its bearer bear carries. So, that was pretty cool. It's a very story-driven game. I like it. I like the animation. I like the look of it. I just healed from that. And let's see where, where this takes us. Little horsey thing. That's a, that's a bad guy. That is a bad guy. Can I hurt you, bro? Oh, I think that's... Advanced Technique, Parry, Counter-Attack, Retribution. Press right mouse button to... Right mouse button. Press right bumper to parry. This maneuver allows you to counter weak attacks and deflect heavy strikes. During a counter, press the X button at the moment of impact to perform a retribution increasing the force. Confused. Right bumper, right bumper, that's what it is. Hold up. Oh, you have to time it, I see. Okay. That. I actually want to practice that. Oh, I thought those spikes would kill you. I want to restart this real quick and practice that. Because that was, that's a very important mechanic. So it's gonna respawn everything that just uh, was there. I wanna not carry this guy. No, I cannot. Okay. So let's go. Yeah, perfect. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, oh, God. Can't kill them. Okay. What is that? You've acquired Verdialis. What? <laughs> in order to use this prayer, open the inventory and equip it. Verdialis of the Forsaken Hamlet, song that filled the air during the festivities of a lost village. Its power finds its way through the floor um, and continues through walls and ceilings, harming the enemies. So, it's a prayer. Equipped. Equip a prayer in your inventory and then press left trigger to evoke, invoke it. Prayers in some combat techniques use up fervor, attack, and execute enemies to fill up your fervor bar. Interesting. Wow, I like it. Lock. Oh, I get up there. Wow, that does a fair bit of damage. How do we get up there? Look, this game has secrets. I want to know your secrets. I guess we can't get up there yet, or maybe I'm just low IQ. Smooth brain. Smooth brain. 
Oh my god, you can, uh, what's it called? Uh, can I do that over there? Let's see. Grap grapple? Clamber. Clamber is the word I'm for. Can I clamber this? Somehow, some way, magic man. Alright, I don't think I can. I think that's something else we do. I have a feeling we're gonna be coming back to places and going. That just that just seems like this type of game. We could totally skip that guy. Ooh, we dodged that. Advanced technique air impulse. Press right trigger plus X in the air to send after hitting an enemy. You can do hit this up to two times before landing. It's right trigger. Oh my god. You'll find them in Children of Moonlight. You'll find them caves all over Custodia. You can release them with any technique at your disposal. There's a little bit of lag there. Interesting. I'm wondering, um... What, uh... How to do that ability, it just told me. You know? I'm just saying, story continues. The plot thickens. There is no answer to our plea. The miracle has forsaken us, and my ornate throne turns its back on those who wait here. Fascinating. Alboro. Press to open up your map. Okay, so this is my map. I guess this is the places I've cleared. Quite sure what green means. Oh, these are pins. Okay. We shall heal! Set up a checkpoint. I don't know what this does. And use it. Onward. Oh, delightful dying people. Can I get up here? Ooh, what do we have here? You have acquired do dove skull. Oh, delicious. Equip rosary beads in your rosary to improve the characteristics of the penitent one. Find additional knots to increase the number of beads you can equip. Sounds really intriguing, this whole game. Skull of a bird drilled as a uh, call it. It's apparent frailness slightly strengthens the penitent one's defense. Alright, I am the penitent one. There's a door to the right. I don't know where I'm going. Sorrowful be the heart, penitent one. Welcome to Albero. Sanctuary to this humble brotherhood of the kissers of wounds. Few remain here who can still employ it. But Tirso is my name. There Hello, are so. few of us who still care for the sick and ailing. With devout kisses, we bless the wounds of those the who seek our protection. Them? Thus, both we and they remain at the mercy Unhygienic. of the miracle. Time outside these walls passes by strangely. In sundowns, we need not contemplate. But if your penance happens to carry you under set skies, be so kind as to bring us some ingredients for our ointments. Okay. The will in the miracle shall show you which ones they are. I got you. I got you. I got you. Onward. Onward to victory. I don't know where we're going. But it's gonna be pretty cool. Hopefully, I decide to go this way. What is this? Hopefully, not a magical boss that's about to kill me. Oh, all right. Penitent one, you who carry the painful guilt in your cracked hands. Lend it to us and alleviate our burden. Lend it to us 
glistening white wings. What in God's name is happening? Because it is an act of penitence. It took my sword. Oh, what in the hell? Is that Jesus? <laughs> On my handle? Virtue of Mi Culpa hath ascended. Visit Mi Culpa shrines and increase the power of your sword. You can also spend Tears of Atonement to unlock combat techniques. Visit additional shrines and increase Mi Culpa's uh, Mia or Mi. I think Mia. Mia Culpa's strength to access more powerful techniques. I need someone to like tell me what's up. So if anyone knows how to say these things and I'm saying them wrong, please tell me in the comments below. Uh, this is like a skill tree. We have 500 of the, the mark, so 2,000. Sinful Wrath concentrates the power of the Mia Culpa on the blade, allowing the Penitent One to release its full potential on a single but incredible de devastating attack. Uh, weight of Sin, it takes advantage of the speed to f of a fall to perform a powerful range attack. That actually seems really useful. The Penitent One takes advantage of the dodge and pulse to thrust the Mia Culpa at the enemies farthest away. Hold X while dodging. This one, like the jump, this one seems really good. I think I'm gonna lock. We gotta hold it. All right, we got it, boys. I like these names though. Last words, ascending edge, sinful wrath, holy wrath, wrath of the twisted one, perverse blood, sacred blood, bleeding miracle. Weight of sin, weight of justice, consecration, sacred thrust, sacred lunge, sacred onslaught. I'm down with it. All right. That is not a doorway we can go. So we will go over here. We will go back up. All the way up. Can I jump? Yeah. There we go. Let's get it. I don't know. I feel like I should not go in this direction. That is... Oh, you tempt me. I will get that one day. I don't think I, I have what it takes. I'm not trying to die like that just yet. Ah. Interesting. Thou hast called upon the witch of the order of the true shrine. Interesting. In this place, we gather the remains of those who were separated and forgotten. So we can grant them holy burial as our charitable rule prescribed. Help us, these poor souls, O oh, penitent one in silence. The order blesses you. Alright, thank you for the information. I really want to get that. We will get that. Uh, can I leave a pin here? I don't know what these icons particularly are, but I'm going to icon that. So, left the pin. Oh, an item just in the middle of nowhere. Required phalanx of Brandon, the grave digger. Rip, rip to you, sir. Left the map, it's pretty simple. Brandon Joshua Hollins dug the graves of hundreds throughout his life, whether friend friendly or foe but when the chaos arose there was no one left to return his favor i'm not quite sure what that's for oh my god that's what that is oh okay i don't want i don't want it i don't want it anymore wasteland of the burial chamber this thing looks cool all right well Woo! I'm trying to do that move. Yeah, isn't that... What? I see, okay. Let's go. Anything down here, though? Oh, dear God, what in the hell? Jeez, that's uh, 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 that's not um. Oh, there's more. Oh, we can shoot it down. Ooh, I can I can hit. 
Poor woman, you know? I mean, look at her. Impaled. Cool. Interesting. You're not gonna get us. I, I don't know, like, what I'm doing with that, but... Can I get down there? That's my question. Probably, yeah. I didn't want to do it! No! Exemplaris. Excom... What? Excom... I can't pronounce Latin. I'm assuming that's Latin. Alright. Press right trigger to dodge. Use the dodge action to crouch through small spaces. Alright, well thank you for the information. We're gonna get through this real quick. I can feel strong. There. Just gotta get a hang of the game. Ooh, a doggy! It's like the highlight of my gameplay right now. I'm kidding. It's pretty fun so far. I'm having a good time. I know it's gonna get much harder. I'm gonna have to dodge a lot of stuff. Woo! She's gone. Ripped that body. Uh, can I dodge it? Can I do? Oh! Ooh! What is this? Guilt fragment recovered. I can see why you want to clear everything again. Ooh, that's sketch. Okay, so it's like. Like Dark Souls, those things at the top right of my screen are guilt fragments. I'm assuming I get them for killing things. And, uh, that's how I level up my abilities. Fascinating. What are you? You are an interesting individual. Oh, cool. I keep hitting myself on you, buddy. To get behind you, but I was hurting myself while doing it. Uh huh. Did I just wait for you? Okay, I'll just do that. That looks. That seems easier. Ah. Uh, okay. We're gonna do this. Get away. Away. All right, she's good. We're gonna jump. Jumperino. Wait for you to- Oh! Counter you. Do it again. Oh, boy. You ain't man enough to live in my world. I'm gonna explore down here real quick. Probably die. A delicious death. Get blocked. Again. Again. Parried. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. GG no re again. There we go. Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful man. Oh wait, what did Y do? I wanted to know. This must be where you get to the um I don't know why I like hitting these things. What in Tar Nation? Do you have a deer carcass as a weapon? What is this weird no Oh god, come on, we can do this. Come on. There we go, get out of here. Give me this item that I died trying to get initially. You required uvula of proclamation. What, like, wonderful things. Alright, now we've created an easier way of getting here. I'm gonna go back up now. Jeez, this game is gonna get me going, I swear. I know it's gonna get me going. Okay, I don't know how we're gonna get through that. I'm assuming we're gonna, excuse me, do something that's gonna open that gate. But we have to go here first. Oh! Get wrecked, bro. I'm on my level. Oh, rock people. I can hit those. Get out of here, man. Get out of here. 
You've acquired Capitate of Baroque. Baroque the Herald. Jeez. I gotta deal with you first. Woo! Sliding away. There you go. Can't get to that. Not yet. You're done. Ooh. Haha! We have another child of moonlight thing. I keep failing on that attack, that down X. Slide away real quick. Here we go. Starting to think that the other ability, the holding the X, uh, might have been more useful. We'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. There's a lot of doors here. Patience is a virtue. Oh, I did not block that. Low on health. Oh, no. Die again? We're gonna have to call this episode, everyone. We are, we are a lot. We are over time now. A lot. Where are we going? Oh, what is this? Another human. Sister of mine. As I foretold you, someone is heading towards the Forbidden Gate. Someone who seeks the purge and excommunication of all that is sacred and rests there. No, no, do not place your doubts on me. I am ready. Thank you for your wonderful monologue, sir. Mercy of dreams. What is down here? Of course I can break that. I want to take all of these doors. There's so much stuff. There's so much. I'm afraid like if I go, if I stop here, I don't know where it's gonna save me. Ooh, oh perfect. This is the place we're gonna stop, guys. Look at that. We heal, we save, this is our new checkpoint. Alright guys, thank you for watching episode one. I hope you stay tuned for the rest of the series. I'm having a blast playing this game. It's a bit of a darker series, but I'm down with it. I like the tree thing, honestly. I like the challenge. I accidentally used that. I like the challenge. I like um, the art style, the story so far. It's dark. Reminds me of Dark Souls and Castlevania type of games. So, um, yeah. I hope you guys take care and I'll see you on the next one.